Hello, this is Daniel from GotVapes.com, and tonight I wanted to show you a, a new product that we have from Smoke Tech called the Smoke Tech Redux. And this is a Stardust style, of their own version of a Stardust style of a uh, Vision Ego Clearomizer. And uh, I just wanted to show you some of the differences in it. It's exciting to see that another good manufacturer in China is producing uh, something uh, of this nature that can give you some more choices. Uh, right now I have one mounted on our chrome bolt and it's vaping pretty good. I have a uh, hush in here. I'm using a Panas our new Panasonic E-Fest batteries in here, the silver clad uh, with the E-Fest logo on it. It's a 3100 mAh battery. Um, it's a high discharge performance or a high drain. Um, and before I started vaping, it was right at about 3.80. So uh, this, the cartomizer that comes in the Redux or the atomizer head is a 2.4, 2.5 variety. And here in a second, I'm going to show you some of the differences between this and the Stardust. Okay, so they look very similar, but there is quite a few, quite a few differences. Let me get a clean unit out here with a Stardust. Um, we'll cannibalize this from the yellow. This is the yellow Redux. So let me bring it in focus and hold. Wick placement is exactly the same as it is on the on the um, Stardust but there are some differences. So let's take this apart. At the very top, you have the same style of a tip. Screws out from the bottom. I haven't checked this, but I imagine these tubes will also, our replacement tubes will also work on our redux. So here we have the unit. And here is a Stardust unit. First of all, let me show you the Stardust by Vision and the placement, it's almost exactly the same. Right there we go. Okay. A couple differences here though that I need to point out. The head of the Redux has a single two milliliter, two millimeter wick whereas the Stardust head has two, uh, one is about one and a half mill millimeters. I may be being too technical, maybe it's right about the same. It looks slightly thinner. And then it's also got a thinner wick here. So it's got dual, a couple dual strands. The smoke tech uses the one here. Okay, they both have the pip on the top. I, I am one who's really like the pit because it keeps you from getting juice down in the middle. That's the way I see it. And other than that, they look, they're, they're identical basically. So I'm going to try it first here on camera. I haven't done this, but uh, I already screwed it into the, um, to the Redux here. Got so many items here on the desk. Excuse me. Here's the Redux. I just took the head off. And here's the Stardust head. And it looks, well, I got juice in there, so I can't do that right now. But I did try it earlier, and there was no issues. It screwed right in. It looks identical, except for the wicks. It looks identical. So, um, 
There's a couple other cha uh, differences. If you look, let me put the Stardust back together again here. Not the Stardust. This is the Stardust. This is the Stardust. Okay, now if you look at the base of both of these, um, and the camera's probably not going to pick this up, but let me show you something here. I'll try to get it to pick up. Let me see here. There we go, right there. Do you see the bottom divot, the square-like divot, rectangular-like divot? Let me focus that. It's almost double the size. I don't know how much that's going to make a difference in your airflow. And then on the Stardust, is this a puppy? Yes, it is. Come here, baby. Okay. On the Stardust, the it's just a little bit shorter. The um, Redux, which is right here, I mean, right here, the Redux has a little bit wider band at the bottom with a little bit bigger diamond knurls, a little bit wider from the top to the bottom. Okay, so we have a difference in the wicks, different in the vent hole. Uh, also, if you'll notice, the Redux has no markings on it, whereas the Stardust does have the markings on it, and the Genuine Stardust have the V on it. This doesn't have anything on it. So if you ever get confused and you've got both of these, you know what differences to look for. The differences seem pretty minor. Like I said, the vent holes are a little bit bigger on the Redux. It uses a single two millimeter wick. Wick placements are the same height. They both use the PIP. You can interchange tips, tubes, everything else on this unit. The exciting thing about the Redux is that it's a major manufacturer and so if you find yourself partial to it, you know, it just gives you another choice. And uh, you can use your present Stardust heads on it, I think. And I want to check that here in a second. Okay, so that's the Smoke Tech Redux. And coming with that, uh, these will initially, we don't have the extra heads on it, but like I said, you can use the Stardust heads, but we do have a big shipment of heads and uh, also the Redux Roto. The Redux Roto is cylindrical, uh, um, holds a little bit more juice, um, and it looks a lot like the uh, the VV Nova. And so when he was asking us, you know, to make the names for it, we made Redux, and he says, "Well, what should we call this one?" And I had another name for it, and he said, "Well, the name," he said, "they used the same head, so." you know, they're interchangeable, so we need something with the Redux name, so we came up with Redux Roto for him. I don't even, I, I don't have any samples or anything here to show you, but they should be coming in hopefully by the end of next week, uh, the beginning of the following. So we'll have the Redux and the Redux Roto. And um, the Redux Roto, uh, if he's, everything is what he's saying, it's got the pip on the top too, so the Stardust uh, uh, head should also work on the Redux Roto. So um, we have those coming in as well. One other thing, the, the coil heads on this are, are not etched with the ohms, and I'm, you know we're working with them to see if they can do that. Uh, put the ohm, ohm markings on it. We will initially have all seven colors that they have available. They are packaged like Smoke Tech does. They just package them in a plastic sleeve. They don't. They're they're not candy wrapped. Okay. And sometimes the sleeves come off. Don't worry if you if you don't have a sleeve on yours. They're all clean and unused. But they come in the red. Let me show this to you. They come in the red and smoky. And again, these don't have the milliliter markings on it, so if that's something that's always bothered you, you won't have to deal with that. You got the blue, 
you have the what I call fuchsia pink light purple but this will go good with all of your pinkish stuff and if you're a guy you can say it's not pink that's light purple my man like that you can tell them that. and then they have the green I have the two ball for this but they have the green and then they have clear so I think that just about covers them one other thing I wanted to mention was doesn't seem to affect anything but on the stardust you have a little bit wider well not a little bit but quite a bit wider seal at the bottom let me pull this off and I just wanted to show you that it does like I said in my testing it doesn't seem like it's affected it at all but you'll see the seal for the stardust that I'm pointing at now and then you'll see it's a seal for the smoke tech that I'm pointing at there okay Full disclosure there, they are both very, very nice, both very user-friendly. You can hand these over to a noob, or if you just are not in the mood to fiddle with anything, or your new bully atomizers, or your new CE9s out of the alpha program, or you just want to pick up something and, and you know, like I said, you want to, you know, it just has the same simple tilt and fill it up, then these are another option for you. Again, we've never carried any of the CE4 knockoffs. We only carry the Vision. The only reason we were interested in these was it's made by Smoke Tech. We wanted to see what they were doing with these. They're a good, uh, good manufacturer, so they'll have consistent quality for you. And so if for some reason you find you prefer this and you like it without the markings, uh, we do now have them. So, and I'll show you one here on an ego. But yeah, it's just a very nice uh, vape at 2.4, 2.5, what you get. And then we'll have also 2. Point, that was on the bolt with the, this ego adapter, by the way. And then you'll also have the, um, we'll also have the 3.0 and the 2.0 for them. It doesn't make much sense to go up too much higher than that with a, an ego type clear measure, but if the variables come, coming out. Maybe we'll have to rethink that. Okay, the egos. Okay, now this is going to be at about 3.3. 3. It's a regulated Joytech Ego. So that's what I just wanted to show you today. The new Smoke Tech Redux debuting first at GodVapes.com. We gave it its namesake. And that is now how it's being marketed all over the world and all over, I think, the universe, including Mars. Uh, you know, if they ever do find some people up there to sell to and they happen to smoke. So anyway, uh, thank you very much. And uh, sometime in the future, I'm going to end one of these with a rendition of Blue Suede Jews dedicated to the monkey's mama. I promise you that. Bye-bye. But not today. Bye-bye.